Ever heard of a creature that enjoys a good goat smoothie for breakfast? Meet the Chupacabra! This legendary beast hails from the sunny lands of Puerto Rico, where it apparently has a hankering for goat a la carte. Chupacabra quite literally translates to goat sucker. Now don't let the name fool you. This creature isn't walking around with a giant straw sipping on goat milkshakes. Imagine a creature, a mix between a wild dog and your worst nightmare with a dash of alien for good measure. It's said to have spiky back, glowing red eyes and a long forked tongue. Now that's a face only a mother could love. And its diet? Well, the name gives it away, doesn't it? It's rumored to drain goats of their blood, leaving hapless farmers wondering where their goat's life juice disappeared. So if you're a goat, you might want to reconsider your vacation plans to Puerto Rico. But before we get into it, if you like this kind of content, please like the video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Also, let me know if you have any suggestions for topics you want to see in a video in the comments below. Now let's dive in. Now, you might be wondering, is this creature for real, or is it just a bedtime story for misbehaving goats? Let's dive into the pool of differing opinions about the existence of this alleged goat guzzler. Some folks swear by their grandmother's dentures that they've seen this creature. They describe it as a cross between a hairless dog, a kangaroo, and a really bad day. Then there are those who believe that the chupacabra is as real as a unicorn's day job. They argue that these sightings are just misidentifications of ordinary animals like coyotes with a bad case of mange, or dogs who've had a rough night out. Some have even suggested that the chupacabra is the result of secret government experiments. I mean, who needs reality TV when you've got conspiracy theories, right? And let's not forget about the skeptics who demand concrete evidence. They're waiting for a chupacabra selfie, or perhaps a guest appearance on a talk show. Show us the DNA, they cry. But alas, despite the alleged sightings, the grainy videos, and the tall tales, we have yet to see any definitive proof. The chupacabra remains an elusive creature, lurking in the shadows of folklore and the imaginations of those who dare to believe. Well, until we have a chupacabra in a petting zoo, I guess we'll never know. From terrorizing livestock to becoming a pop culture sensation, our friend Chupacabra sure knows how to stay in the limelight. Now let's talk about how this beast has managed to slither its way into media, movies, and TV shows. Have you ever noticed how our hair-raising friend always gets the villain role? I mean, can we get a rom-com featuring a misunderstood chupacabra looking for love? No, instead we get these horror flicks where the chupacabra is always the bad guy, terrorizing small towns and giving everyone nightmares. And let's not forget about those action-packed video games where you, yes you, can take on the role of the chupacabra, leaping over fences and sucking the life out of virtual goats. Talk about a power trip! Even in cartoons, our friend is depicted as this scary, monstrous creature. Where's the chupacabra that enjoys long walks on the beach, or has a passion for modern art? Who knew a goat-drinking monster could become such a celebrity, right? So what's the final say on our notorious chupacabra? Well, after gallivanting through goat pastures and tiptoeing around tall tales, we've certainly had a wild ride with this mythical creature. The hilarity of the chupacabra myth lies in its constant shape-shifting nature just like Aunt Ethel's meatloaf recipe. Is it real? Is it a figment of our overactive imaginations? The debate rages on. Whether real or not, one thing's for sure, the chupacabra will continue to haunt the dreams of goats everywhere. 